Welcome to Grandma's Reading Corner uh, at homeschoolforlife.org. And to subscribe, just click below. This book is The Very Clumsy Cricket, Garrett Carl. Oh, it's not a cricket at all. I can see the adhesive on top of it. It is the very clumsy click beetle. It's a beetle. And look, it's laying down, flying, buzzing around. One fine morning, a young click beetle decided to go for a walk. So there's the big sun. The sun's coming up. And here's the beetle. He's going for a walk. And then at, there was morning. Now at noon, he climbed up and down a flower. So there he goes. Looks like he went up. Now he's going down. Because his head's pointing down. So you can tell he's going down. In the afternoon, it rummaged through a pile of pebbles. Pebbles are rocks. So, so he's exploring, looking through the rocks. In the evening, it crawled among the tall blades of grass. Look at that. A lot of grass. And there he is. Let's see if you can find the beetle before I do. And when it turned night, the young click beetle creeped up in a, a tree. After a while, it got tired and fell to the ground. It landed on its back. The young click beetle tried very hard to turn it over onto its feet, but it couldn't. Help, it cried. Did you find the little beetle? Yep, there he is. He fell out of the tree and he's on his back. Looks like some help's coming. All along, the wise old click beetle had been watching the young click beetle. Tomorrow morning, I will teach you how to click and flip through the air and land on your feet, said the wise old click beetle. In the meantime, you may as well go to sleep. Good night. <laughs> the next morning, the wise old click beetle said, Look at me. This is how it's done. First, it turned onto its back. And then, with a loud click, I'm showing you how he's doing a flip on his back. It flipped through the air and landed on its feet. Now you try it said the wise old beetle. Thank you. That looks easy, replied the young click beetle. Just then an earthworm stuck his head up out of the ground. Look at me, said the young click beetle. Look, there's the young. And with a loud click, it flipped through the air. There it is. What is this here? What is that? It's a turtle but it landed on his back. How very clumsy of me, said the young click beetle. Just then a turtle ampled by. Ampled means kind of walking slowly. Better luck next time, said the turtle. Keep trying. Look at me, said the young click beetle. And with a loud click, see there he is. It flipped through the air. <laughs> What do we have here? But it landed on his back. How very clumsy of me, said the young click beetle. Just in a snail slithered by. See, slithers mean it doesn't really walk by or crawl by or run by. It just kind of swishes along, slithers along. Don't worry, said the snail. You'll get there. Look at me, said the young click beetle. And with a loud click, it flipped through the air, but it landed on its back. How very clumsy of me, said the young click beetle. Just then a mouse scurried by. Scurried means he was going fast, wasn't he? You mean, I? you need a little more practice, said the mouse. Look at me, said the young click beetle. And with a loud click, it flipped through the air. But it landed on his back just then. Oh, what was this? The young click beetle had never seen anything so big. 
It could not move. It was scared. What did it see? Someone walking. Could be a little girl or a little boy with the shoes he'd never seen. A person with shoes. So he was scared. Because he's big. Oh. Quick, click, and flip. Cry the rise old be click beetle who was watching. So she told him, quick, click, and flip. He looks, yep, the little boy. He's looking at the beetle. And the young click beetle clicked and flipped through the air. <laughs> By this time, it had three graceful somersaults. Look at that. He got away from the little boy. Look, see all the loop the loops It's going around and around and around, wasn't it? A lot of somersaults. Landed on its feet. Look at you, shouted the wise old click beetle. You have done it. <laughs> Very good. And for more books and resources, just um, go to homeschoolforlife.org and just click the subscribe button below for YouTube.